What is up guys? It's Razor. Welcome back to Let's Play Metal Saga. In the previous episode, we got a we bear, we dug up a bunch of buried treasure in the desert north of this place. In this episode we're going to go back to the desert and get the, that tank that we left up there. Because we left the tank up there because we didn't have we couldn't tow two tanks. So, we're basically going to go drop off the buggy in this episode. And then we're going to go ahead to that desert and get that tank that we, that we left up there. Before we do that though, I'm going to sort through all that stuff that I got in the last episode. Because as you can tell, we got a lot of stuff here. So we got this 100mm SBG, that's very powerful. Okay, so let's give that to one of my tanks. Uh, I guess I'll just give it to the Mosquito. Let's see here. Uh, that subgun is 48. This one has 41, but this one can be upgraded. I'll probably upgrade this one, so this will be more powerful. No, I didn't want to install it. Going to transfer it. I'll give it to the D-Mag. See, flamethrower. That's pretty bad, actually. Uh, this one's not too bad. I'll give that to the other. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and equip some of this stuff. Yeah, that weapon is so powerful right there. Wow. Okay. Gotta give her some armor. Oh, crap. We're completely immobile here. So that means I'm gonna have to... Uh, transfer some of that stuff over. Some of the stuff I'm not using. Over to the buggy. There we go. Now we can move. But we have to go store the other stuff and then we also got to take the buggy and drop it off somewhere. I'm trying to think what else. Oh yeah, let's go ahead back to the junkyard. Oh, we can teleport back here anytime, so it's fine.
Okay, so we're going to store some stuff and then we're going to drop off the buggy. So let's head down here to the parking lot. And we can actually leave our vehicles here. Let's go ahead and select drive, drive the buggy. And then we'll park it right here. Drive, exit vehicle. No, I didn't want to get in that vehicle. Demog, Mosquito, there we go, and now let's head back to the desert and go pick up that other tank. I need to go repair my tanks though first before I head up there. Crap, I should have I should have stored stuff. My bad. I gotta go back to the junkyard. I should have stored my vehicle parts on my other vehicles. Oh, that's a lot of money. There we go. We're all set. Let's go ahead and teleport back to... Oh, yeah. We can just teleport to Morgue Town. That's right. We don't even have to teleport back to Beldare or whatever. Oh, the Morgue Town's a lot closer. It's like right at the desert. Or it's actually in the desert. And the tanks to our west. Wait, it might have got impounded now that I think about it. Since I left it, it might have got impounded. I don't know how that works exactly. No, here it is. Still over here. Anyway, if you didn't see last episode, uh, there's a lot of ghost tanks around here. And you can get uh, a lot of EXP for battling them. Alright, now we got the Panzer. Which is a definite upgrade of what we have right now. Yeah, that is really good. Now I gotta, now I can get rid of the D mag and uh,
and install all this stuff on the D on the Panzer. It's gonna lose a lot of HP, but. We're gonna tow the D mag and we're gonna ride in the Panzer. There we go. And just so you see here, the chassis, uh, the Panzer can hold two SEs, which is really good. But it's also a very heavy uh, thing, so you need a very good engine for it. This engine right here is not going to cut it. But you get plus 30 defense while riding this, which is pretty good. I just put it in perspective, the Mosquito has plus 10. So, this has extra 20 defense than what the Mosquito has. So that's really good. So you definitely want to come up here and pick up that, pick up that tank. And just leave the buggy back at the uh, one town like I did. It's not gonna go anywhere, so don't worry about it. It'll be there when you if you want to get it later. You may want to head back here and upgrade. <coughs> Sorry about that. Been recording a lot of episodes today. My throat's getting a little dry. I could get the durability up, but I think it's good. Definitely gonna boost our attack though. Very expensive to upgrade your tanks in this. Okay, now I think I can give an SC weapon to the Panzer, so I think I'll go uh, pick one up.
Isn't the Panzer a uh, German tank? Like, I, I don't really know for sure. I think it's a German tank, right, guys? I'll be honest with you guys, I don't know much about tanks. <laughs> so, I'm just guessing there. Uh, oh yeah, I was going to store... Or wait, what was I going to do? I already forgot. Oh, I was going to get an SE weapon, that's right. I should have some of them in here. Yeah, here we go. We got the pitching bomb, which is garbage. Vaporizer. Napalm cannon. I think I'll just pick up the napalm cannon, I think. Or let me let me see what the popcorn cannon does. Cause the popcorn cannon is a lot weaker, but Okay, it's all enemies, that's why, okay. Alright, so yeah, we'll replace that with the... Uh, uh, napalm. So yeah, that's a lot of damage on that one. And you can see it on the back back there of the tank. Not too bad. Um, trying to think of what else I wanted to do. Well, I'm probably going to save it here and uh, oh well, yeah, we can get some more. Uh, we can trade in some more scrap armor. That'll bring us up to 19. I'll go ahead and save it. And then I'll think of what I want to do. Alright, so I'm going to head uh, back to that desert. And um, there's one more buried treasure that, that I need to get, so I'll go ahead and get it. I forgot to get it in the last episode, so I'll go ahead and get it now. And there's an enemy I want to avoid, though. Uh, it's a wanted mission called the Bomber Prince. I do not want to encounter it right now, so... So I'm going to stay away from the path that it shows up at.
because I don't want to encounter it right now because it likes to flee. And you want to defeat it before it flees. And I'm not really uh, strong enough to kill it before it flees, so I want to uh, learn a new ability called Disarm, which will allow me to prevent it from fleeing. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get it first. Here we got two new enemies. But that little bird, that bird enemy, and them, and that tank up there. Free range foul. I have no idea what that does. Oh, I could be sold at a bartender. Okay. Anyway, let's hope we don't run into the bomb prints. The item we're going to dig up is right over here. There it is. Here we get the crimson shirt. Which is an upgrade. Plus six defense. Nice. Alright, now I'm gonna head back to E Zero. And like I said, I can encounter the Bomber Prince right now, but I'm gonna head back I'll come back and fight it later. And there's also another wanted mission I could battle too, but I'm not gonna bother with it yet either. In the next episode we're gonna take the train. So I wanna thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode where we'll head on the Continental Railroad. Should be interesting. So make sure to check out the next video. And later.